guys welcome back to one of my videos in this video i'll be showing you part two of halloween crafts so the previous video we made the mummy i'll put the link in the description so we made the mummy and it's really cute and interesting you can put it in the kitchen i'm not so sure if it's good for outdoor though so in this video we will be making a hand monster raw so the first thing we'll, the things we'll need is one glove. I by accident grabbed two gloves. So one glove, one piece of zip tight, or a piece of tape, or not glue, no glue. A zip tight tape, or or anything else, just not glue. Here is um. Three googly eyes. You need three googly eyes any size, just not too small because it won't be visible. And one sharpie. And just in case, you can cover yourself with a blanket just not to make it too messy. So the first thing you'll do is I recommend first making the face. So the first thing you'll do, I highly recommend starting with the drawing with the Sharpie. So you'll draw any type of face. I'll just draw like a happy face. Okay. Do your best on doing this. This is a very easy craft. Just the zip tight. Some people won't have it. But if you do have it, write in the comments if you have zip tight. After coloring the mouth, you your mouth will look like this if you're drawing a smiley face. Then the next thing you'll do is put the eyes. So first you'll take out one eye, put it there, one eye. You can put as many eyes as you want, but I highly recommend putting three eyes. So, I'm just going to plop them in. So, after doing the eyes, this is one of the hardest parts, but we'll do it. Keep the zip tie right here, very close to you. Before we use the zip tie, make sure your eyes are well sticked to the thing. This, this is going to be rough. You go like this, you grab the salt, open the large cap, as I showed in the other video. And then the thing you'll do is literally just cover it over like this, just like that. And then you're going to just flip in, flip it. Just one second, let me attach it. So the hardest part is to attach it. I recommend making it like, like that and yep, it's almost in. And make sure it's fully sealed fully in because if it's not in it's gonna make a big mess so then you just flip it over and don't just let it fall down there's one thing you'll have to do to make it fall down you shake it shake it very hard until it falls so I'm gonna finish that part and do it almost full half so after you have filled in it half you will just check out how it looks. So, I put it upside down. So, the thing you'll do now is grab zip tight. So, you gently put it down. And then, you put the zip tight down. And then stretch out, stretch it out. Wait, camera should be like this. Then, after doing that part, um, you will close the zip tie. All of you should be knowing this. So, you see here, you just put into the small hole, and then you'll be able to see what what's going on. You see here? Yeah. So, however, you guys, if you have zip tie, you probably know how to do this. So, my camera is actually zoomed in now. 
So now you just have to put it into this small hole. So this could be tough sometimes. Well, I don't use zip tie really often except for decorating for Halloween. And on my channel, I'll post a video of how my house is decorated. I'm not done decorating yet. So we'll wait. So after you do the zip tie, uh, it will be sealed. And it will be, it'll look like something like this. So now you can hold it and enjoy it. So now you can lay... Now, I'll put it to the normal side. It will be like this. Well, I have to fix my dip, zip tie. I'll be right back. Okay, so I replaced the zip tie because these blue zip tights, they're very cheap. So, I recommend using a better zip tie. But if you want, you can use the blue one. It's very hard to use it. And here you go. Your, your upside down monster hand. You know, it could be either way. So I like to make it upside down. But you can do it the opposite way. But the hands, you gotta shake it a little to make it the opposite. Because if you, I specifically making this video that it's upside, it's an upside down monster. So it wouldn't really have like fingers. Like it will have full fingers. So I prefer making it like an upside down monster. That makes it scarier, right? So yeah, guys, this is all for this video. Um, so see you in part three. Happy early Halloween.